Reverse angle parking is an easier way for people to park their vehicles. Uh, it's not dissimilar from parallel parking, but it's easier because it occurs at an angle rather than at, at parallel. I don't know, I probably heard about it 10 years ago at least, um, and it seemed interesting to me. And again, it just goes back to growing up in Norman and always having found it to be somewhat problematic to park on Main Street and get out sometimes. The pilot project is located on the west side of James Garner Avenue uh, between Apache and Sims Streets. Well, the, 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 the design behind the pilot project is, is number one, to get people familiar with how to back angle park. We want to investigate over the next several months if there's any issues people are having. Do we need additional signing? Uh, is there any kind of marking that needs to be added to the system to make it foolproof? I think it's a great opportunity to use one block um, on James Garner Boulevard to try this out. Um, and then, uh, as it has been mentioned in some other meetings, we're about to convert Gray Street back to a two-way street. It used to be two-way. Converting it back and we're going to be installing on-street parking on both sides of it in some areas where it doesn't exist. We're looking at doing the reverse single parking there uh, should this pilot program work out very well. The parking maneuver for back angle, back in angle parking is not very different from traditional uh, parallel parking in that you pull past the space, you signal your intention, you put your car in reverse and you back into the space. There are some additional things that I think people shouldn't understand about back-end angle parking. Uh, it's a lot safer. If you think about how you back out of a space on Main Street right now, it's very difficult if you're in a small vehicle, if you're parked next to a high-profile vehicle, it's hard to see to get out of the space. About the best you can do is look in the, in the windows for the reflection. When you're leaving a back-end angle space, you're pulling straight out and you have a, the ability to see. But there's another issue that's a lot safer for children and for loading of vehicles. If you think about how people offload children right now, the back doors open up so that they're directed towards the street. In a back end angle parking situation, they're directed towards the sidewalk, much safer for the, for the children. Uh, if you're loading your trunk, right now on Main Street, you're standing in the street while you're loading your, your packages and your stuff in your trunk. In a back angle situation, you're doing all that from the sidewalk. I'm a big, I'm a big proponent of things like roundabouts and uh, trying to get rid of traffic signals if we can and, and allow traffic to move more consistently and flow and things like that. So I'm all about any innovative or new ways that we can implement in Norman to help us have safer streets and safer ways to park and go shopping and do the things you want to do.